verse uh, 14. Back to the poem. Freya rules in the ninth land, Folkvang. That is where she arranges the seats. She chooses half the dead who die in battle, and Odin takes the other half. Okay, so this one, I, I think we, we eventually got to this one being one of the trickiest to to really flesh out its its importance and its meaning. So what it's saying here is that is that uh, Freya chooses half the dead. And not just in, in this stanza, but in others, I think they do imply that Freya gets to choose first. Yes. Which is really interesting because, first of all, Odin is supposedly the the father of the slain, the father of the the dead, and and, he, and then he's the one who's most associated with it. But then there's Freya, who is very, very clearly a war goddess. Now that you, now that we see her uh, ruling over a realm of the dead, and yeah, it's just it's just really interesting that she uh, she gets to choose first. And the only thing that I can really get to is that this this is some kind of alternative, possibly something to do with feminine influence, like we were seeing, you know, the integration of the two sides that maybe there does have to be that side of it that is ruled by the feminine sort of thing. But uh, yeah, there, I, I'm really at a loss actually for exactly what this stanza means. And and it is possible that we've lost some key meaning. There's there's some scholars who speculate that. I think H.R. Ellis Davidson, a fantastic scholar of, of uh, Old Norse and of uh, Old Norse uh, um, history and things like that, uh, she she speculated that uh, this one just might be something we've really lost the key meaning of, unfortunately. So, well, if she thinks that, that makes me feel a lot better about not knowing anything. <laughs> <laughs> uh, one thing I could get, uh, Folkvang means uh, something like army field, and the, the people who go uh, to this place. They also engage in sort of that endless battle that you see in Valhalla. And there's, there's a lot of similarities actually b- between Valhalla and this place. So it, it makes it very uh, curious about what is the difference between the two. I, I wondered if it was the, when the Aesir and Vanir came together, if she was sort of the, the psychopomp or the, the person who ferries the dead over for the Vanir and Odin being the one for Aesir. And so they they kind of uh, merged the two so that there I guess sort of less infighting, but you could you wouldn't have to uh, you wouldn't have to choose. You could sort of figure out um, the 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 gods and goddesses would figure out for you which place you were gonna go, and that would sort of equalize it and smooth things over so that there could be better t- integration of the t- two uh, tribes. Yeah, that really is the only other thing that, yeah. I, that I personally thought of was just the fact that it's these different tribes, different possible destinations, and that's one way of of integrating that. And, and maybe on a cosmic sense, maybe that just says something like, you know, if you have different um, personalities or different uh, um, uh, d- maybe different ideas about life, like I went to maybe men who have a family or a more family oriented and maybe more in tune with some of these feminine ideas, maybe they would go there and they would be happier there versus Valhalla, maybe as more of just a rah, 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 big military, uh, setting sort of thing. But then, you know, the name of the, the, the thing, like the, the field of the army, like, okay, like the, <laughs> that's still pretty clear. So, I mean, it's, yeah, re- really, uh, the, all of this is just guessing as far as I'm concerned. And, and I want to be very clear about that. Like this is pure speculation, but wild speculation, but it, it, it's still interesting to me. And, and, and I think even just these little, little ideas here, give us some hint of, of why there might be these different, uh, these different destinations here. Right. So for sure. <laughs> 